Alright, so the next video in the series is Grishka Point Shoes also. This shirt was ironic when I bought it. It says not without my point shoes. I think it was from Covet Dance. Actually, that was funny because I generally always have a pair of point shoes with me in case, you know, photo shoot opportunities come along. So anyway, Grishko, which will not be a very long video as you can see. I personally don't like Grishko, which is funny because I wore them for most of my, like, young years dancing on point. And I never killed them. This pair is still alive, like, for the most part. They're just too hard for me and the vamps are way too long. So anyway, but I gave them a try. So my first pair, like everyone else in the world, was Grishko 2007s. I don't know if I had other pairs that I threw out. I honestly don't know. Um, this is my original pair. So, that's what they look like. Um, I did put the duck, this is more recent. I tried to make them work for me more recently to see if maybe it was like, now I know how to break them in and stuff. I mean, the box is fairly soft, but the shank is still like, I three quartered it as best I could since they're sewn. <laughs> so even though they're sewn, I still tried to three quarter it, um, which is why it's taped inside. And I still, it's so hard, it is rock solid. <laughs> so that's those. So then when I went back for a fitting like seven, eight years ago, they were like, oh, you should try the, what are these? They're like the Grishko 2007 Flex or something. I don't know. These did not work for me. These, one of these, I think it might have been this one, like the shank like snapped like within like me putting them on, which is weird. And then like I still, the box is too hard, the vamp's too long. So I colored them purple because you know, why not? I wasn't using them. So photo shoot purple shoes, which don't make my feet look good. So these are also 2007's five double X and these were a five and a half double X. So then I wanted colored ones and they make colored shoes. So I really wanted to give it a go. These are, shoot, Triumph? Yeah, these are Grishka Triumphs. This was like I did an online fitting with Best Point, I think, um, and these two were the ones they recommended. I don't think the sizing is quite right. These are a five double X super soft shank or something. I don't know, SS. Um, but these are Triumph. These look beautiful. They're these gorgeous red satin. Um, they just don't fit my feet well. Like I was like not able to fully get over the box. The vamp's way too long. The shoe's too hard. So that's a no. And then these were the Nova Flex. I really didn't like these. Um, the, the purple color is so pretty. Oh, so pretty. But these shoes just did not work for me. So that's these. Um, they're very cushiony, but I just didn't like these shoes. So I tried. I just really wanted them to work because I wanted colored shoes for photo shoots. See if I was that ridiculous. The one pair that did work for me enough, but not enough for me to keep dancing them because I can't roll through them. I can't do demi point. <laughs> these are still so hard. Are the Grishko Mayas. These are the Maya One. So these do look really pretty on my feet. I can balance in them and everything. But like, they're so hard. I've never been able to break them in at all. Like I can't, nothing. So this is why Grishko just doesn't work for me. So that's my experience with Grishkos. They're not my shoe. They're never gonna be my shoe. It's just how it is. Just with my particular feet, they don't work for me. It's great when they work for other people, but for me. So that's my personal experience with Grishkos. I'm not saying they're not a great shoe. For people they work for, they're probably fantastic. Just like. Suffolks are great for me, they may not be great for other people. So, um, the next one I'm probably gonna do is, I'm gonna redo Suffolk, Block, and Gainer, just because I've got updated information on what I wear for those. So, and we have all the time in the world right now, so why not make more videos because people seem to like these ones. <laughs> so, this is all based on my experience. This is not me telling you what to buy or me saying these are great or terrible shoes for everyone. This is just me personally and you know, it's fine that I have this many shoes. I've been dancing on point since I was 14 years old. I'm 32 next month. So I have had a lot of point shoes, a lot more in the last like seven years, but still, you know, when you're an adult, you're more trying to find a shoe that really works for you. Your feet aren't changing. You're just trying to find what works. So I'll see you guys next time.